Hey, listen, bro. But I, but I want y'all to understand why I go in on y'all and everybody in the whole world and all you world leaders. You feel me? And this is why, because why? Because I'm a weapon of war. I'm a prophet. Every prophet is a weapon of war. You feel me? God uses us to destroy and to bring down or to bless. You feel me? Bring to build up. You feel me? And, bro, I'm a weapon of war. And, bro, as you see in verse 20 right here. The portion of Jacob is not like them, for he is the former of all things, and Israel is the rod of his inheritance. The Lord of hosts is his name. Thou art my battle axe and weapons of war, for with thee will I break in pieces the nations, and with thee will I destroy kingdoms. See, it says, I'm a hammer and a weapon of war. You feel me? With me, he's going to break nations in pieces. And with me, destroy kingdoms. That's what I'm doing. I prophesied your death. I threw the rock and the crooked stick into the waters that you saw. You feel me? On my Sony Global shit. Bro, you are dead. Do you understand me? You are dead. You are dead. I am a weapon of war. That's why I go in like I go in. That's why I talk the shit I talk. You feel me? Because, bro, all I have to do is speak it and it will come to pass. But I don't need no gun. I don't need no weapons. I don't need no nuclear codes. I don't need none of that. I don't need no pills. I don't need no knives. I don't need no arrows. I don't need no bows. You feel me? I don't need poison. I don't need no chemicals or warfare. I don't need no nuclear nukes. You feel me? All I do is speak it. You feel me? And it says in verse 21, it says, man, listen, now listen. This, this, all the people I'm going to break down. It said, with Verse 21 right here. With thee will I break in pieces the horse and his rider, and with thee will I break in pieces the chariot and his rider. And it said, With you I will break in pieces the horse and his rider. With you I will break in pieces the chariot and the chariot. That means all y'all niggas on the horse, your rider, you pull it. You know what a horse and a rider and a chariot and chariot is? Through the police. Uh, back in the day, the horse and the rider were like the army, the force. You feel me? But, but the enforcers. You feel me? And y'all, you feel me? Your, your cars, you, you call them horsepower. You feel me? And that's a chariot. You feel me? And that's what you are. All your chariot, all your military, all your government. Nigga, I will destroy you. Nigga, your end has come. And I'm going to destroy all of you. Nigga, ain't no, ain't no, I'm sorry. Nigga, fuck, I'm sorry. Y'all nigga hurt me. Nigga, I'm gonna hurt y'all back. Nigga, fuck you. Like, for real. Let's go to the next one. Read this right here. Look at this. Verse 23. Now, verse 22. With thee also will I break in pieces man and woman. And with thee will I break in pieces old and young. And with thee will I break in pieces the young man and the maid. And it said, with you I will break in pieces man and woman. With you, I'll break into pieces the old man and the youth. With you, I'll break into pieces young man and the young woman. Bruh, everybody's finna get this shit in this prophecy, bruh. Y'all finna get killed. These persons are gonna beat your wives. All you women are gonna get raped. All you men, they're gonna beat y'all. Your children, they'll whoop your kids, even babies. Especially you, 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 you people pregnant. I'm telling you what these people are going to do before it happens. Do not say you was not warned. Even if you put me down and say whatever to me, don't say you was not warned. Nigga, I'm teaching you right now. I will also break in pieces with thee the shepherd and his flock, and with thee will I break in pieces the husbandman and his yoke of oxen. And with thee will I break in pieces captains and rulers. And it says, verse 23 says, With you I'll break into pieces the shepherd and his flock. With you I'll break into pieces the farmer and his team. With you I'll break into pieces the governors and commanders. You feel me? I would destroy. That's why I'm telling you. That's why I'm at you governors and commanders. You feel me? Because I would destroy you. You would never destroy me. The Bible said he would use me to destroy governors and commanders. Do you understand? And all you world leaders and all you governors and commanders, you are going to die. 
That's why I come at you like I say, nigga, fuck America. Fuck you, government, nigga. Fuck your government, nigga. I would destroy you, nigga, with the word of God. All I have to do is speak it, and it will come to pass. Nigga, I would destroy you. Y'all some pussies. All you government officials some pussies. Y'all some bitches. You understand me? Around the whole world, you world leaders some bitches. You understand me, Donald Trump? You a bitch. The American government a bitch. Because my God will use me to destroy you, and your time has come for you to die. America will fall. Fuck all of you. Straight up, nigga. And I will render unto Babylon and to all the inhabitants of Chaldea all their evil that they have done in Zion in your sight, saith the Lord. And it says in verse 24, and it says in verse 24, it says in verse 24, I will repay Babylon and all the inhabitants of the chariot before your very eyes for all the evil that they have done and Zion declares the Lord. He said he will repay Babylon and all the inhabitants of the Chaldeans, which are the Persians. You feel before my very eyes. So we are supposed to watch it. You feel before your very eyes, you will see the fall of America. Before your very eyes, you will see the fall of these governors and these rulers and these war leaders. You will see the Persians destroy these people. Before your very eyes, everything that I have said will come to pass. Because nobody knows this prophecy like I do. I have been studying this prophecy. I have been keeping track of this prophecy. I have been watching this since I came out of Coastal State Prison. I have been watching this prophecy. Nigga, before I went to Coastal State Prison, I have been start studying this prophecy and watching this prophecy. Been since, since I changed my life and God called me, this was a prophecy he had called me and he has been teaching me. And I have been studying this prophecy for years now. Since 2013, I have been studying this prophecy when I found this prophecy. Nigga, and now I am bold and I have learned enough to be bold to speak on this prophecy. But I'm telling you, bro, y'all niggas don't want this, bro. But y'all don't want the Anna, bro. But y'all niggas think y'all do. Bro, this, this is why I talk this shit. I talk to the government and to the government officials, to Donald Trump, to any world leader, to any government. This is why I talk this shit. So this is why I talk my shit. I don't give a fuck. Do you understand me? Because I'm a destroyer myself. Do you understand me? You don't know who you messing with. Y'all want to mess with me. Y'all don't know who you messing with. I am a destroyer. I don't need guns. I don't need weapons. I don't need nukes. I don't need none of that shit. I will speak it. Nigga, I will speak the word of God to stir the people. The people will kill you. I, but I'm telling you, but I could turn the people against you, Donald Trump. But I could make the people kill you just by prophesying, Donald Trump. You United States government. I could make the people kill you just by prophesying. You don't know who you're fucking with, bro. I am a weapon of war. Please do not mess with me. Please respect my religious right. Because I promise you, I will make these people kill you. Don't play with me. I have the spirit of God. And that is a powerful and an ammunition. And I'm a prophet. My words are deadly. You do not want me to speak against you. You do not want me to speak on you. You do not want me to curse you. Because I promise you, whatever I open up my mouth and say will happen to you. I don't give a fuck. Do you understand me? I'm a man of God that don't give a fuck. I'm the man of God that don't give a fuck. Do you understand me? You've met the man of God that don't give a fuck about shit. They've taken my life. I have nothing to lose. They've taken my life. They've taken me away from my family. And this is my second chance. Nigga, I have nothing to lose. I have nothing at all to lose. Nothing. They've took my life in 2015. Nigga, this is my soul. You're looking at my soul, nigga. You're looking at my soul, what you're about to lose. The soul and flesh, nigga. And I promise you, y'all gonna pay for taking my life. All you bitch-ass motherfuckers. I'm not playing with y'all, man. Nigga, y'all know this shit, government. I'm telling you, government, nigga. I don't give a fuck about you, American government. Nigga, I'm telling you, you ain't gonna do shit to me. None of you gonna do shit to me, nigga. Fuck Donald Trump. And I'm telling you, Donald Trump, you ain't gonna do shit. You a bitch. That's what you is, a bitch. And you always be a bitch, Donald Trump.